Hi everyone, this is Crafty Decoria and I hope you're all doing great. So I managed to get out to the Dollar Tree this weekend. I didn't think I was going to go since I had gone on the Wednesday and I normally don't go during the week. But I did go back to the same Dollar Tree that I had went to on Wednesday and there were a few more new items to be found. I didn't get to my regular Dollar Trees this weekend, but hopefully I will get there next weekend. So as usual, here is an overview of the things that I picked up. I will go through them one by one so that you can have a better look. I hope you enjoy. So to start off the haul, the first thing that I picked up are these Tomcat Mouse Killers. They kill up to, it says it kills up to 12 mice and they are a kid resistant station so this is what it looks like here and the bait is inside and then they eat it and it is poisonous so um, you get one disposable bait and one 28 gram bait block so for Tomcat brand, I thought that was a really great find at the Dollar Tree. I then picked up some leggings, and these are really, really nice quality. They are by Street Legal. A while back, I did get some leggings, but those ones were more dressy. They had a shimmer going through them. I picked them up in black and in brown and they had like a copper shimmer and a silver shimmer going through them. They were really pretty, but for something to wear every day, these are really nice. So I picked up a really pretty pink, fuchsia, gray, and black. These next items, I was so happy that I came across them. The first, <clears throat> excuse me is a shaving cream by wit and wisdom new york and the scent is spice cedar and there is 6.7 fluid ounces 200 mils in here and i had read some reviews on this and apparently it is a really nice shaving cream so i was really happy to come across these and then i picked up a couple body mists now these are by candy crush and the orange is pastel pyramid and the green is rainbow runaway and they have a very candy like scent to these and i did spray them in the store and everyone that walked by were like wow that smells amazing and they really really do i wish i had picked up a few more but when i go back hopefully they have them there because i really really like this and I even really think the packaging of these is really nice. Then I came across some Nivea Cream Soft Care Soap. And I picked up two of these. There's a hundred gram in each bar. And then I also saw the lemongrass and oil. And I really like this one. Again, 100 grams. Then I picked up this Herbal Care Euro Style um, Shea Butter Shampoo, and it is paraben free, and it was a really nice size bottle, 700 ml, and it is Shea and Macadamia. So it says it helps tame frizzy hair and I was really excited to find this and I can't wait to try it out so I picked up the shampoo as well as the conditioner some items for the bathtub so the first thing I picked up this kid zone unicorn bubble bath there's 18 fluid ounces in here and then to go along with this bubble bath, I picked up this adorable rubber ducky unicorn. So that would be really cute to pair it up with this uh, bubble bath. And then 
I've never seen these myself. I came across these bath drops and this is the Crayola bath drop. It is fragrance free water coloring tablets and they are non-toxic. There is 25.5 grams in here so there's 15 colorful bath tablets. So I picked up this one as well as a Peppa Pig. Again the same amount. Fizzy Tub Colors. And then I also saw a Paw Patrol. And this one <clears throat> is a little smaller, 20.4 grams, and it has 12 water coloring tablets. So that was a fun find. So the next items that I will be showing you are all seasonal. So I picked up this tote bag. It's adorable. It says, you don't know how much I love you. And it has the donuts on the front. And then on the sides, it has smaller donuts with this really pretty pink color. And then I picked up some more of the gift boxes. And these ones here are my favorite. These have the tops and bottoms that are solid and then the sides you can see through. So if I zoom in, you'll see that the sides have hearts all over them. And these are great for gift giving or even just if you want to display them like this. They are so, so pretty. I did pick up a set of these in the winter Christmas decor. Um, and I did do a DIY. If you care to see what I did with those boxes, I will post the link in the description box below. And you can see these are really pretty. These on the top have a red and pink bow and then little hearts all over them. And then it is red and white striped. So pretty. And then I picked up the heart boxes. And these are really pretty as well. So I did get them in the three different sizes. And these have the see-through or open window in the front of the box. And then on the inside, you can see that it says XOXO. And it has gold hearts all over it. And then XO on the bottom of the heart box as well. Those are such pretty boxes. Then I picked up some more uh, pennants. Well, actually one. This one here I had not seen before, but is so pretty and it says follow your heart. So I picked up a couple of those. I picked up this full of glitter love you sign. Just thought it was really pretty so I'm gonna have to spray that with some hairspray another sign that I had not seen before this one here says follow your heart really pretty this one with what looks like the faux wooden behind has a red glitter heart and then Love in metallic gold lettering. Really pretty. And then the last sign that I picked up is more of a farmhouse looking sign. It looks like there's some red barn wood in the back with the burlap and love painted on the burlaps. It says love is all you need. Really cute. I picked up four of these L-O-V-E ceramic um, decor pieces and I only saw the four there. I believe last year they had them in pink and red, I believe. I can't remember for sure but I know they had them in silver and so I did grab the last four that I saw. If you saw my haul 
during the week you will know that I did haul these two decor signs and these are like um, an MDF board nice and strong and I did see them again as I went to the same Dollar Tree that I went to during the week and so I did pick up a few more because I absolutely love these and I just thought maybe this might be an item that sells out and maybe I wouldn't see them again so this first one says bless your heart and it is my favorite of the two and then the second one says love grows here and then the rose and the heart on these decor pieces are lifted it's another wooden piece that's lifted from the actual uh, box itself really pretty though I picked up a couple of scarves there were three different ones but I picked up these two as I like these two the best so the first one just has the X's and O's all over them and last year I did make a X and O garland, a pom pom garland. I will post the link in the description box below if you care to see how I made that. I just thought this would be really cute if I cut some pieces and made bows and then just tied them or even just not even made a bow but just tied them in a knot and then added that to the garland as well as they do say X and O or hugs and kisses and then the second scarf I picked up has the donuts um, the way that the tote bag had and I just thought they were too cute that the scarf was too cute to pass up so I picked this one up as well and then I picked up some more of the travel mugs and I remember last year I really liked the ones that they had last year because they had that little plastic lip that you could fold over and it would close the hole and I was hoping these ones would have them as well but they didn't however they are very cute this one says love conquers all the second one says you stole my and then heart and then the third one says you hold the key to my heart so really really cute I did like the ones last year better but um, these ones are nice it's always nice to see something new just the same so that'll do it for this Dollar Tree haul. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, share the video, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And as always, guys, you take care of yourselves, and I hope to catch you in my next video. Bye-bye.